you're looking east over the newly flooded river we built in the Portlands. While the river has been pumped full of water to match the lake level, it is still separated from the lake by an underwater wall at each end. The river will pour out into Lake Ontario here, at what was originally Polson Slip. On the left, you can see where we have removed the hardened dock wall to create a more natural water's edge. Promontory Park South will have a water's edge promenade and landscaping to create a lookout point over the inner harbour. You can see the rise and elevation beginning to take shape. The fish coves we built here are continuing to thrive. Fish surveys conducted by the Toronto and Region Conservation Authority in 2023 showed 23 species of fish in the coves, including Chinook salmon, American eel, emerald shiner, rock bass, white perch, and walleye. The full new Cherry Street alignment is now open. You can see the road, sidewalks, Martin Goodman Trail, and the space set aside for the future dedicated transit. Excavation has begun to connect the Don River between the Keating Channel and the northern part of the New River Valley. Now we're looking south and flying the path that the New River will flow. The water filled up the main river channel over the course of about two weeks, and water has also filled up the wetlands that surround it. Now that the river is flooded, we're turning our focus to constructing the new parks. We've started shaping the land for a future picnic lawn and terrace on the right. You can also see a pebble beach where you can eventually pull up a canoe or kayak. The orange tarps beside the fire hall show where we're starting to install playground equipment, including a water play feature and swings. <laughs> 